stress and lack of sleep increase your blood sugar levels a lot more than you actually think. When you're stressed, your body releases hormones that push your blood sugar levels a lot higher. The same thing applies to poor sleep as well. So that way, when you're stressed, you don't sleep. It is very hard for your blood sugar levels to stay controlled. So what then do you do? We need to find ways for you to be able to control your blood sugar levels by finding ways in which you can just relax. Let's think about the things that daily help you to relax. And then we need to find ways in which we can involve them into your day-to-day -day activities. Because when you're relaxed and you can switch off and you can sleep, that way your blood sugar levels do not spike as much and you have a better blood sugar level control and a better diabetic control. Try relaxation techniques. Some people meditate. Seven to eight hours of sleep to help your body to recover is what is actually recommended. Remember, don't just manage your food options only. Manage your stress levels, your sleep levels, and you keep getting the ticks because you're on your way to a better blood sugar control. How many hours of sleep do you get in a day? Leave us a comment and let us know. See you again another time.